Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be talking about Cali Muscle. And this guy right here, well, he really never ceases to amaze me because of the type of individual that he is. And th I know I'm going to get a lot of flack, and I always get flack about when I talk about different people in the fitness industry and my feelings about them. Now, if you look at Cali Muscle, Cali Muscle is basically uh, one of those type of people that does what he has to do to make money. And when you are that type of individual, normally there are no limits to what you would do for money. Basically, it's like a, um, what do you call it? A, uh, a money poor, in other words. It's like a prostitute for money. He basically, uh, like most uh, people in the fitness industry, uh, prostitute himself for money. And before you start saying that I'm hating on the guy, what in the world do I have to hate on him about? Nothing. I, because he have nothing that, that I would want. Um, or nothing that I would need. So I'm not hating on the guy and I don't dislike the guy. My only thing is, is that over the years of being incarcerated and locked up, uh, Kelly Muscle have developed that um, uh, street mentality that he do what he have to do to get where he have to go. And that's, that's, that right there within itself has a limit. If you ask me, it has a limit to what, to what, a person would do for money and based upon the things that he do I don't I don't think he have a limit to what he would do to make money I mean if you take for instance uh, he take a bodybuilding channel and then try to turn that bodybuilding channel into a uh, more or less a gamer he be you know and he's pretty much looking at uh, other little kids that's, that are gamers. And he's trying to capitalize on that. Um, that's just one way of him trying to uh, capitalize on making money any way he can. Which is, you know, you're looking at a, a almost 50-year-old man uh, talking about being a gamer. And... Like, there's nothing wrong with it. Do what you want to do. But it goes to show you the character of the person. You know, the character of the person. You know, um, it's not like that he's a true diehard gamer and that's what he want to do. He, he's not that. He would put on whatever outfit that he need to put on in order to get that money. You know, it don't matter what it is. So, an individual like that, I personally would never trust them because I know they'll do pretty much anything for the cash. And a person like that, you really, you really can't trust them. If you look at the uh, the uh, video fresh out, you know that that guy right there is is uh, big hurt. He's pretty much straightforward about what he's talking about, what he has done. Kelly must have talked about what he has done, but he'll never tell you that he's using steroids. Big Hurt then told you what he didn't use and how he didn't use them, but Kelly Muscle would never come out and say that he used steroids because he still want to hold that persona as being, as being natural because that's the draw. You know, you have a lot of natural people having the belief that they can get to where this guy is and look like he look naturally. Now, you now even now, I mean, a, a lot of the pictures and stuff that he showed you that you're looking at him with his shirt off, look at his back. His back is covered with acne. All the signs of uh, steroid use, the excessive size, the uh, incredible... Um, uh, vein sizes, all that are signs of 
steroid use. And even though this guy has gotten smaller, and if you've noticed, he's gotten smaller real quick. Natural people don't shrink like that. You just don't shrink because everything that you have made was actually bought and paid for the natural way. And it just doesn't go away that fast like his did. His was so fast until it was noticeable. Now, if a natural person, naturally, if you get sick or something like that, you know, you'll naturally uh, shrink because of that. But even then, it takes a little time before your body actually wears down. But you look at him, he, 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 it was almost automatic that he shrunk down. And all of the heavyweights, no matter what y'all saying, all of the heavyweights, and, and this is, like I said, this is not hate. This is, if you're in the, if you're in the public limelight, you that you that'll be talked about. If you're in the fitness industry, you that'll be talked about. And that right there is all I'm saying. Uh, I talk about everybody in the fitness industry because that is the interest of all of us, the industry itself. So Kelly Muscle ain't no different, and I and, and you can all say I'm hating on I'm hating on the black man and all this. Other. I don't care about all that stuff, man. I, I'm not hating on anybody, and I, and I never have, and I never will. I'm just telling you true facts. You know, like I said, Big Hurt can sit up and tell you the things that he did, and be honest about it. Same thing. Big Hurt prison got out of prison, did whatever he did. He tell you what he done did, and no problem. Even the drug uses, Big Hurt tell you all that stuff. You know, that's somebody who's just being straight up. You know, that's somebody who's being straight up. Kelly Muscle is still one of those guys that's uh, created the illusion of being natural as, as big as he was, and he's still hanging on to that now. Even now, I don't think, I don't think personally, Kelly Muscle is natural now. I think he's taking as much of the drug as he has to to uh, maintain the little bit of size that he got. But you'll notice that he never lived heavyweights anymore because the strength is not there anymore. It's not there at all. But you all uh, who are uh, uh, steroid believers that you can still hang on to a size and strength after you get through taking the drug, Look at Cali Muscle. He didn't hold on to size. He didn't hold on to strength. But yet and still, you still believe that you can take steroids for an extended period of time and can avoid the uh, travesties of what steroids bring to you physically. I mean, it's hard enough just to stay healthy by yourself. You, you definitely don't need to be taking any kind of drugs to do that. And the sad thing about uh, a lot of the guys that are taking steroids, they, they, they don't stop there. It's always an add-on. It's always something else that they're adding to it, some other type of recreational drug that they're adding to it uh, to help them do what they do. You know, back in the days, a lot of them used cocaine, steroids and cocaine. These are the things that people don't tell you about what's really going on with these people, what they're doing and how they're doing it. And it's like I said, what I say is not hating because none of them have anything that I would want or nowhere that I would want to be. So I, I'm not hating on them. I'm just, if they out there in the fitness industry and they're saying A, B, C, and D, then you're there to be talked about to be admired, if you are there to be admired, whatever the case may be. So that's all I'm doing. But anyway, it's like I said before. Um, Kelly Muscle is one of those ones that would do anything to make a dollar. Anything to make a dollar. And an individual like that, you know, I personally, I, I wouldn't trust him. You know, me personally, you know, looking at the guy's physique that he had, I believe that this guy 
was on heavy steroids because he, his body had all the signs of steroid use. Even now that he's gotten smaller, I still believe that the guy is still on steroids. So, either way it go, whether he admit that he's on steroids or not, uh, you could take that. You could take this particular guy. Is like I said before. He'll tell you only so much to try to keep your money coming in. And my thing is, if you're gonna get the money, you know, just get it honestly. Be be straight up with people. Let them know, you know, what it actually takes to 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 get to where he was. Instead of you know playing around with the uh, the fact that you are saying that you're natural all the time. Even now, with all the years of uh, excessive uh, drug use that he's got, it just, you know, he's saying that he used other drugs. You know, he'll tell you all the other drugs, but he'll never tell you about the steroids. That's the part that's, that's crazy, you know. No matter what people say about it, that's the part that's crazy. But anyway, that's what I want to talk to y'all about. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. Also, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, and I'll be talking to you later.